Hey, what's up guys? Just thought I'd give you a look at my El Camino here. Um, I've been messing with it a little bit. I got the paint squirted on it. Um, it's got a pretty good shine. You can see that bottle reflecting in the in the roof of it. Um, get her turned around here to where you can get a good shot of it. Um, I'm really happy with the way it's coming out. Um, I was a little concerned because um, all I've been building is uh, is rusty cars lately, and um, I wanted to make sure I could do a shiny one before I started this box stock build. So I decided to uh, put the paint down on this thing. Um, I'm really happy with the way it came out. I've been polishing on it. I think I've got it where I want it. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to leave it alone right where it is. The hood... Um, I had a problem with the hood when I was painting it. I don't know if I shot something through my airbrush or if something got on it after I was done painting it or what, but it's got, um, I had a, it looked like a big booger, I don't know, right, right where the bend is on the front on this passenger side. So I've got that sitting in, uh, stripping right now so I can repaint it. Um, I don't think I'm going to take this car to any shows or anything but you know you paint something you want the paint to be right on it so it's not a big deal but I'm really happy with the way this one's coming out uh, also I wanted to show you this stuff I found this at Michael's in their craft paint section I picked it up thinking I could um, add some flake to my builds and it's it's gold um, they have Probably 10 or 15 different colors there. I don't know for sure. I didn't count them. I'm just guessing. Um, but you can see it kind of it kind of changes color and stuff, but it looks pretty cool. Um, I have played with this a little bit. Um, I shot it on some spoons. Um, I shot it on a white, orange, and a black. Like I say, I just grabbed some random paint and sprayed it. It's just something I had in a rattle can here. Um, and it turned out pretty good I think um, you know I'm, I think it looks best on the darker colors um, I might have went a little too thick with it I think it'd be good if you were doing like a like an old school gasser or something like that you know uh, I think the more you thin it too the less flake you're going to get uh, I haven't really played with it that much I just wanted to see if my hairbrush would actually spray it um, I put it in on the biggest uh, the biggest needle I had. I've got three needles from my airbrush, and I use the biggest one, which is like a point seven or something like that. I think I'm not sure. I've got a, I know I've got a point two and a point five, and I've got one bigger than a point five, and 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 that's the one I use. So um, the airbrush will spray it. Uh, the flakes aren't that big in it, but I think maybe. You know, I was talking to a couple guys at the hangouts, and they were saying something about usually flakes you want to use bigger needles. So that's what I tried, and, and that's the results I got um, so far. I mean, I'm going to keep playing with it. But like I say, I, I like it on the black, but it may be a little too much if you were building like an old-school hot rod or something where they used a lot of flake in their paints. and Or maybe like a bass boat. You know, bass boats have a lot of flake in their paints. So, But, yeah, I think... Um, I think it looks pretty good. Um, I do want to say thank you to everybody that has made comments on my daughter's video. Um, it's very, very easy for me to persuade her to do these builds, um, especially when she gets great comments like that. Um, it makes me happy. It makes her happy, and uh, she gets really excited about it. And she is really excited about starting her box stock build. She keeps asking me if, if we can start it yet, if we can start it yet. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, probably going to end up starting on Saturday with her. And uh, I think uh, I think it'll be fun. I'm really looking forward to it. We're not going to do any, like, updates on her car or anything. I'm just going to, like, take random videos of her working on it like I've done in the past. Um, yeah, I'll probably, I don't know, I'll probably start mine... Um, I'll probably start mine, I'm thinking about starting it early Saturday morning around like midnight, something like that, you know, um, just to kind of, kind of get it going. Um, but the paint that I've used on this El Camino, I did want to mention that, 
is uh it's just this fast color stuff it's an rc paint it's used for uh um, you know, you can use it for paint for Lexon, model car bodies, or other surfaces. It, it works real good. I've got a few different colors of this stuff. This is, uh, they call it fast pearl white, but it's just a pearl white. Um, but yeah, I'm really happy with it. It lays down relatively smooth. Um, I've used it on a couple other builds that I've done. Um, but yeah, I think that's all I got, so... I'll talk to you guys later.